Well, found at almost any table, vegetables are good for you, according to science, a source of vitamins and minerals. But it is also possible that this delight could have come from the unluckiest of places. Want to know more? Watch this story. A green leafy vegetable garden tucked away in Jiru along Kangunda Road in the outer fringes of the city of Nairobi and what to any consumer would be an eye candy. But at this seemingly rosy cover of lush vegetation, the details may not have a rosy smell. As the city expands and sucks up all the water for irrigation, these untreated liquid, what is waste discharge from homes, commercial premises and industrial plants from the entire Nairobi sewer system, seems a viable option for farmers here diverting this artificial river into this land, more than a hundred acres of vegetable crop. A place of plenty in and out of season, and that offers a variety of traditional delicacies, from Sukumawiki, to managu, terere, pumpkins and arrow roots, and one that provides a livelihood for tens of women here who come here daily to eck a living deep from the mounds of the earth, and a business that has been thriving here for almost 25 years. With a big and ready market, not just around this farm, but also around Nairobi, much as the consumer may squirm at this idea, it is a good one for the farmers at least. This irrigation water comes with fertilizer free of charge in the form of nitrates and phosphates bound up in human waste and the results are often clearly visible. The bad news however is that these vegetables that find their way into the markets and eventually into your plate could be laden with harmful material such as heavy metals such as cadmium or even bacteria. Food contamination in this case cannot therefore be ruled out. And while this agricultural practice may seemingly be forbidden, at least theoretically, it is unofficially tolerated and it continues unabated a truth that unfolds when the Citizen TV crew visited the farms. While sewage water can be useful if treated, then recycled, much of it here is raw, gushing directly from sewer pipes into the fields, and if such vegetables sell freely in the markets, the importers of hygienic food handling, such as thorough washing of vegetables before preparation, cannot be overemphasized. Tomorrow we'll tell you what risks these foods pose to human health. Sheila Sendel for Power Breakfast.